All right, here we go. Oh yeah, it's another one of them, their mystery packs, but this one is a challenge. Both me and Rob Finds Treasure ordered one of these $150 mystery packs off of eBay. We both did, and we're gonna do a challenge to see who gets the better pack. So as this video comes live, as you're watching this, Rob's just went live as well. So as soon as you are done, make sure you go down below in the description. I'll also put it in a comment and make sure you go over and check out Rob's pack as well. Leave a comment on both videos and let us know who you thought had the better pack. Additionally, guys, uh, don't forget, Rob is almost at 100,000 subscribers. That is an insane number. Help him get there. If you guys are not subscribed to Rob yet, go over there and make sure you are subscribed after you watch this video, of course, and help him get to that 100,000 subs. And of course, if you're not subbed to me yet, you know, make sure you do that as well, because you never know, you may not be. But seriously, guys, we are excited to get into this mystery pack. Now, the one negative thing about this mystery pack is uh, when we ordered it off of eBay, we ordered this like a month ago, and it literally took us an entire month to get there. The guy said that he was having some medical issues with his family, so at least it's here. And uh, not as quick as we wanted, but we're going to get into it. So let's go, guys. All right, so here we go. Now, this mystery pack, as I'm opening this, I'll tell you what it says. It is supposed to have 13 total coins. One coin will be graded by a third-party grader, either NGC, PCGS, Annex, etc., Six coins, six other coins will be pre-1965, 90% silver, in good to AU, BU condition, or maybe better. Five other coins will be 90% US silver coins that are not pre-65, uncirculated or proof, uh, that are uncirculated or proof. And then there will be one Mr. US silver coin, his choice, that will come in a purple sleeve. That's what it says. And at least four denominations guaranteed. So we are expecting... Uh, we are expecting 13 coins in here, and we are looking to hit 157.95. That is 150 plus the 7.95 shipping that we paid. So about 158 bucks is our total investment, and we want to see what we have. It's only 13 coins, so I'm hoping we have something good. All right, so my hand is in there. I feel multiple things going on. Let's see. This feels like... All right, that has multiple coins in it. I'm going to put it back before I look too close. All right, let's see what we have in here. Is this our first ever good mystery pack? Like, well, we've had other good ones, but here we go. First coin. All right, we have the free silver gift. Sorry for the delay. Remember I said there was a major delay in this? Well, that was very, very nice of him to uh, to give us an extra. Wow, look at this. It says, uh, wow, TOFS 017.5. Uh, you got a 1944 S MS 66. It has some major toning on the reverse. I do not recognize that error. Triple die obverse. FS, FS. Triple die obverse. All right, hold on. All right, guys, I had to actually pull up Google and look this one up. So FS 017.5 is listed on PCGS as DDO FS 101, and then they put 017.5 in there as well. But it shows that there is a DDO on here, and this actually has really strong auction listings. In fact, they have a uh, PCGS certified 66s that have went as low as 99 and as high as $216. For the first time, we are actually going to get the coin scope out on a mystery unboxing and take a look at it. But this DDO, I believe, is in, in God We Trust. So let's look at it under the scope and see if we can see that DDO. All right, so we are zoomed in and take a look at this. It is actually a DDO. Look at this N right here. You see that? That is a definite double. Look at the T. Look at right here on the R. Holy smokes. It looks like a little bit in the D as well. But definitely over here, uh, you can see right here in the R, you can see uh, even a little bit on the G right here, actually. It's a little bit harder to see, but it is there. Definitely see it on the N and the T. Wow. Looking at the auction records on this, I mean, you know, this obviously isn't graded. But honestly, I would say at RAW, just looking at this coin, let's get it really close. This is a 4K camera. I mean, there's some toning on the back, but there's no wear. It is all there. I would agree this is at least an MS-65 all day. Guys, our first bonus coin, this is the one he sent us saying, sorry for the delay, was, in my opinion, a $40 to $50 coin. 
and we have not even gotten started. In fact, this is supposed to be a bonus coin uh, because it took us a month to get this. So holy smokes, this may be one of the best mystery packs we have ever opened and we're just only looking at the first coin. This is beautiful. Holy smokes. All right, well, if the person that uh, sold me and Rob these mystery packs on eBay actually watch YouTube videos, he didn't say he knew me like the last one. Um, thank you. And uh, wow, uh, maybe I uh, should put the link in the description. I mean, for once, I normally don't do it. But whenever you see something awesome like this, maybe you should call them up. So guys, here we go. Number two. And by the way, we're going to officially value that at 40 for the tracker. So the tracker down below, I'll put 40 on. But that could be worth as high as 50. All right. So number two, we've seen these. 1982 George Washington. This is a half dollar. This is the uncirculated one. You can tell because it's in the blue. And the uncirculated one comes inside this little thing right here. These are really, really cool. I value these at around 12 bucks. This is 90% silver. Uh, $12 is what I'm going to put on this. That is really, really cool, guys. Uh, these are absolutely gorgeous uh, George Washington half dollars. So $12 right there. Very, very nice uh, for the 1982 George Washington 150-year commemorative. All right, so here we go. We'll kind of get this out of the way. Let's get into the plastic bag that was inside the bag. Here we go, number three. Take a look at this. We have a silver proof quarter and a NGC certified PF69 Ultra Cameo slab. Uh, this, I would say, probably 15 bucks all day, maybe even as high as 20. I'm going to officially call it 15 for the tracker, but you know, you can probably get 20 bucks for these, uh, really, uh, when they're in these slabs like this. And it has a really cool American National Treasures uh, label with the flag, PF69 Ultra Cameo. That is absolutely gorgeous. Wow. So, so far, man, I wonder how Rob's bag is because I don't know what Rob's bag is like. We're probably doing this at the same time. All right, here we go. Number four, another silver slabbed quarter, this time Minnesota, 2005 Minnesota PF69 Ultra Cameo. Uh, so there is another one that we are going to value at 15 bucks. I like the label on this one better, but this is an actual state quarter. It's certified. Let's go 15 bucks on that one as well. That is really, really cool. And keep in mind, we're talking retail prices here, guys, not wholesale. Um, so if you were to go into coin shop and buy these, I imagine somewhere, you know, around 15 is what you're going to be looking at. All right. So here we go. Next up, this is another slab. Another one. Also silver. 2005 S Silver West Virginia PF69 Ultra Cameo. Unbelievable. Guys, this seriously is one of the best mystery packs I've ever opened. And so far, we're only five coins in out of 13, technically out of 14, because this is supposed to be a bonus. We'll see if that's true or not, or if he just upgraded it. All right, so here we go. Hand in uh, another slab. Guys, I'm not even kidding around. I knew there were more than one slab in it when I pulled it out to open it, um, but four... Here we go. Another one. 2006S Silver Nevada PF69 Ultra Cameo. That is 15, 30, 45, 60. Uh, what did we say in this? 12. So 72, not including this. We're five coins in, six if you count that one. Oh my gosh, guys, another slab. I'm not even kidding around. I thought there was a couple in here, but five? Is it another silver quarter? Let's find out. <laughs> it is 2008 s silver arizona pf69 ultra cameo that is that is incredible 15 30 45 60 75 dollars right there on the uh certified slabs i didn't feel another one in here i think that's it yep so that is it for that little plastic package it said one purple sleeve coin i'm sorry i ran out of sleeves like we said earlier and the free gift all right, so next up is another little package. I'm going to try and open this without pulling it out because I can feel. Yes, so I'm getting this open without actually pulling it out because I can feel where it's sealed. All right. Okay, well, I got it through a lot of finagling without actually looking in here. Um, that being said, when I felt, when I was trying to get this bag open, when I felt it, I did feel another slab. Guys, is this another silver quarter? Do we have six silver quarters in this one? This one says silver coin, something, something. All right, here we go. Oh my gosh, a silver eagle. Wow. 
1986, guys. That is the first year and a better date. Are you kidding me right now? This is literally... I don't know if... Listen. I don't know if this guy felt bad because it took him a month to get this to us. I figured this would have been plenty for that. We just got a 1986 Silver Eagle in an NGC slab MS-69. I mean, MS-69 for a 1986, probably around 50 bucks. Seriously. At retail, of course. But holy smokes. Wow. $50. Wow, that is cool. All right, so let's see. Where are we at? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, so there's either going to be six or five more in here, depending on if this coin counted as one of the coins. But this is far and away the best mystery pack I've ever opened, and we're not even done. All right, so the rest of these feel like two by twos. All right, here we go. First one. All right, we have a 1944S Mercury Dime. Uh, that right there, today's silver prices is going for around $2.20 to $2.30 at retail. All right, next up. Bam, we have a nice choice BU. It says here 1950 Washington Quarter, 90% silver. That is gorgeous. Oh my gosh. All right, so the only junk coin we've really gotten so far is this 44S. But so what this has been awesome all right here we go all right so we have a 1954 benji this is insane oh my gosh uh uh yeah by the way another 11 bucks on the tracker i forgot to say what we were going to do on this washington quarter uh 1950 in that shape guys at least 10 dollars. so we're going to count this one as 10 on the tracker and 11 on the tracker 220 on the tracker uh, for those and I think we said 50 15 a piece this one we counted as 12 and that one we counted as 40 on the tracker I don't even know what that adds up to right now all right here we go next up bam another Benji 1952 oh my gosh oh man another 11 bucks on the tracker guys I'm not even messing around this is so cool all right there's all right there are two more so five six seven oh wait wait Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So he did send this as a complete extra bonus coin outside of the 13. I feel two more. All right, here we go. Bam. All right, so we have a 1953S Roosevelt dime. Even like that, even nice and shiny like that. That one's still just going to be around silver melt. So not silver melt, but around 90%. So an extra 220 on the tracker. And guys, finally, in literally one of the best mystery packs I've ever done, and I'll do the math here in a second. We'll put the tracker down below. But here we go in three, two, one. A Walking Liberty Half Dollar 1943S, heavily circulated, but still 11 bucks on the tracker. Okay guys, Future Seeker here. I went on eBay and double checked all of my pricing. I was pretty accurate on almost everything except for these. I was a little bit pricey on these. After shipping, these are averaging around 10 to $12 a piece. We're gonna go ahead and call them $12 a piece instead of 15, which means we will have to subtract $15 from the total. But even after we do that, we're still at a total of $209.40. Now, if we remove this, the $40 that I counted for this one right here, we are still over what we paid for the bag at uh, $169.40 even if I didn't get the bonus coin uh, with a cost of $157.94. Now everything again I'm saying is retail pricing, but you have to admit this is really, really good. This is far and away one of the best mystery packs I have ever opened on this channel. If you've ever, never seen any of the other ones, make sure you go check them out. There's a playlist, you can check them all out. Um, but I hope Rob's is just as good. So if you guys, again, don't forget, uh, Rob's video is uploaded. There's a link in the description below. Make sure you go down and check out Rob's. Leave a comment on both videos. Let us know which one do you think is better, mine or Rob's. Also, don't forget to subscribe to both of us guys if you haven't done so yet. And additionally, thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you guys next time. Have a fantastic rest of your day. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I did leave a video above you can check out if you haven't seen it yet. I also want to give a huge shout out and a huge thank you to my awesome channel supporters scrolling right there on the right hand of the screen. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you in the next one.